Hey guys, what's up? It's Ashley. We're standing outside of Catbirds, which is on Montrose. Pretty cool bar. It's really interesting. Got a lot of personality and style. Been here a couple times, had fun both times. So uh, let's go see what we can find today. I'm Ashley, by the way. Hi, Ashley. Holly, right? Holly, yes. How long have you uh, worked at Catbirds? Almost two years. Two years yeah. So you've seen it all then. Seen it all. Especially on Montrose, I can only imagine. Yeah. How's uh, Halloween like? Actually, Halloween's insane here because the, we have the pub crawl on Halloween. I did it this past year. So it actually gets so full that we have a wait, mm -hmm. you know, for population reasons. It took so. us forever to get in here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but it's a lot of fun and the people watching is great. Yeah, the costumes. Um, how is it with neighboring bars, you know, being so close together, almost like a six street feel? Well, I think that, you know, I think that we're a little different. I mean, you know, we're one of the neighborhood bars, of course, but people come here for different reasons and they go to, you know, Royal Oak or Boondocks or whatever. So we're a cool kind of chill jazz bar. And there's definitely a different clientele on um, the weekend nights. It's kind of people come in from the suburbs and explore. But it's, me. it's not too bad. Coming from Cyprus, <laughs> all the way down here to party. It's a drive. <laughs> it is, especially driving back. That sucks. Which is why you get a designated driver. Yeah. Or ride the wave. <laughs> right, right. Hi, I'm yes. Ashley. Hi, Justin. Justin, nice to meet you. Gabby, nice to meet you. You guys are regulars here. Yeah. It's cool. How often do you guys uh, come in here? Uh, a couple times. Yeah, a couple times a week. What's the crowd like uh, on the weekends? Neighborhood, people, neighborhood people. Yeah, on the weekends you have more people coming mm -hmm. outside. On the weekends it's like party atmospheres are usually pretty relaxed. It's like a mix, really. You've got, I mean, you've got people from the neighborhood coming in and people coming from other neighborhoods as well. Um, during the weekend it's more laid back. Weeknight or weekend nights really good. Yeah. Crazy. We're about to take a shot called a breakfast shot. They're claiming that it tastes like breakfast. I just had breakfast at what time is it? Four o'clock in the afternoon, which is why I was late. Sorry about that. <laughs> But uh, let's have some more breakfast. <laughs> what do you put in the breakfast shot? Um, well, I usually don't tell people because secret? it's kind of a secret. All right, we can leave it a secret. All right, let's leave it. So they have to come to Cat how about, how about if yeah to check out the breakfast shot? It's a secret. <laughs> all right, so the deal is you have to chase it with the orange juice. You don't have to drink all the orange juice, just enough to like make right. the flavor to justice. <laughs> That's breakfast. That's freaking awesome. Doesn't it taste like breakfast? It's like, because my friend the other day said he had a breakfast shot and he was probably here, but yeah. like, the honey or like, you know, like with sausage kind of thing and then the orange juice, it's pretty good. Hi, I'm Ashley. Mike. Mike, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Have you been to Catbirds before? Oh, uh, I have. How often do you come? Every once in a while. Every once in a while? So you live in the area? Close enough. Close enough. <laughs> it's in the range. It's in the range. Um, so what do you like about Catbirds? I like it because it's, uh, you know, you get some more places, it's loud, it's crazy. You, know, you come over here, it's relaxed. Mm -hmm. You can have a beer, you talk to your friends, meet new people. So the music, yeah. I can hear right now. Yeah, you can lounge. hear it, but it's not, it's not intrusive. Mm -hmm. All right. You know? This one's really easy. It's just pinnacle whipped cream flavored vodka and orange juice. Cool. You come here and meet different people that you maybe you wouldn't socialize with you otherwise mm -hmm. I and you know it's so it's fun to sit there and talk to people that go wow i would never talk to them anywhere else here i gotta to talk to people that are totally different than i am mm -hmm. but and you have a connection level different age, yeah because we just enjoy just you come here you know we're here to talk to people everybody's fun everybody's nice and everybody's willing to talk which is great that's really cool yeah. Duffy, anarchist, come on. <laughs> salud. Yeah, salud. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Cheers. 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 Doubled up. Salud. Cheers, Duffy. 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 Sunday fun day. <laughs> Done right. Yeah. Mm. I'm Ashley. No? Nice to meet you. What's your name? Jay. Jay. Farrell. Nice to meet you. Um, Krusty Chuck here was just telling me that he was kicked out of this bar for a year and was just allowed back in, and I'm intrigued. Why were you kicked out? I, uh, I, I pushed, um, 
Someone poured two drinks on my head, so I threw them over one of those tables over there, and then reasonable my answer. Friend tried to stab the bartender for kicking me out, and then the cops came, and then that was shit a year happens. Ago. Man. Hey, it took me a year for you. So you obviously like this bar enough to oh, want to come it. back. Tried, oh man, I got kicked out here 30, 30, 30 times after that. I kept coming in and trying to get drinks when they weren't looking. He loves the bar. A guy named Mike that I just met over there, he was, you know, he's talking about how it's just different people you would normally not hang around with. So many different people. That you just get along with. So, Sometimes, a lot of the time. That's why I wanted to interview. I mean, you got tattoos and shit on your face. You've been kicked out for a year. He came back. They're forgiving, apparently. Just apologize and be nice. Oh, no, Have it, a took, good time. it took a lot to get back in here. Nice. Well, welcome back. <laughs> Thank you very much. All right, well, it was nice meeting you guys. Uh, Had fun. It was good stories. Krusty Chuck. <laughs> Montrose, obviously, and Washington, these streets here. And Houston, I mean, we've got a lot of great bars, a lot of things to offer. Catbirds is just a really unique flavor, I guess, to it. It's real chill, but it can also get that energy that you want. They've got really cool music, just interesting people. And... Hanging with the interesting people makes your life more interesting. So coming out here, I mean, you can, you can go other bars. I'm not going to name any, but here it's got the just that oomph that you need. So you know, I, I like it. You can try it. It's good.